So now that you've seen a language calendar entry, I'm hoping you noticed that Gina used the KMPs to develop phonemic awareness and also pulled in the handwriting stories as well. It is all integrated and intentionally overlapping. So let's make another connection. Let's bring a word from the language calendar entry over to the vowel house and we'll use the KMPs to look at how the word sounds and then we'll use the vowel house to figure out how it's spelled and which window it belongs in. Now we're gonna take the word nose from our sentence and add it to our vowel house. So let's look at our windows. We see an O right here in one of our windows. This is the A ah window. So would we put the word nose in the A ah window? Do we say n, n as? Is it an as? No, we say it's a nose. So we have to look at this window, the O window. And we see big mouth E right there. And we know he makes O say his name. O, O, O. And what does O say? O says, that's my name. Leave me alone. So we're going to add the word nose to the O window. Okay, so here's our O window. We're gonna add the word nose to this window. So let's look at this wave right here. Does this wave mean that we need a letter? We don't have to have a letter because this wave can boot the letter right off. But in the word nose, we do have a letter that belongs there. So let's stretch the word nose. N-O-S, nose. So now we're going to write the word nose. So we hear n first, and that actually goes right along with the word nose. N is a nice nose. He goes down and away from the monster. Then we hear that O, that long O, and S, S is so silly. He goes toward the monster, away from the monster, back toward the monster. And then we have that big mouth E. I'm gonna give him his top hat and he makes the O say his name O O O and now we have the word nose. Fantastic job today. We reviewed the K sound and we talked about the C and H together saying CH. We wrote a sentence with both of those sounds and then we even added a long O word to the vowel house. I'm looking forward to learning together again.